Hey everybody, DeLong Strat Signatures here. This is part two of my IndyCar Hero Card Autograph Collection. Uh, this is going to be K through Z. Takes up two binders just to get through all of these names. Uh, just a few years ago, I only had, I think, two Hero Cards in total for IndyCar. Very few names, uh, mainly people that drove in both NASCAR and IndyCar. Had nothing for it, and uh, it has grown quite a bit since starting to collect it in 2018. Uh, got some new ones this year, uh, both from going to the track as well as my standard uh, yearly team hero card requests. Most of them sent new hero cards. I did get some uh, repeats from last year, um, so that kind of stinks, but uh, always worth writing to them. It's probably one of the best um, in terms of you know percentage returns uh, for an active racing series. So we're going to get started here with, uh, looks like he's a, I think he's a P2000 driver, uh, Kiko Porto, Kiffin Simpson, Kyle Kaiser, and then I sent this off, um, sent off a request to Kyle Kirkwood in his rookie season, uh, I think this is one of his Indie Lights hero cards. Um, so really wanted to get him, and then got to meet him several times at the track. I've got a whole bunch of items signed by him, but uh, also got some more through the mail. So he's a, he was a fantastic signer, like the entire time I was there. This is, <coughs> excuse me, I believe this is Lindsay Brewer of the Indy, I don't remember if she's Indy Lights or... I think she's the Indy Pro 2000. Linus Lundqvist, he's looking to be the next guy to make the jump into the IndyCar series. I'm honestly surprised the team hasn't announced that they've uh, picked him up for next year yet. I um, believe he's still the front runner for the Indy Lights Championship. Then this one would be Louis Foster, also of the Indy Pro 2000. I've had a lot of luck with Marco Andretti through the mail. I, I guess some people don't. Um, didn't get him on a hero card in person this year because most of the, or some of the uh, Andretti Autosport drivers weren't handing out their hero cards. Uh, he was one of them that wasn't, but I was able to get his TTM via the hero card request, which is why I do that. This year's Indy 500 winner, Marcus Erickson. He'll be one of the five competing for the championship this weekend. Although this video is going to be released afterwards, so you guys are going to know who the champion is. My bet is on Will Power. Um, I don't remember if he or Joseph Newgarden are leading in points, but I know all three Penske drivers are eligible. And then it's uh, Marcus Erickson and Scott Dixon. I think Will Power gets his second IndyCar championship. But Marcus was a great guy at the track. He was signing a whole bunch. Uh, Matthias Leist. Then Matthew Brabham. I think I got his dad, Jeff, recently. Uh, Mikhail Aleshin. This is one of the first IndyCar Hero cards I ever got back. Milka Duno. Nolan Siegel. Oliver Askew, there have been rumors that a team could be looking to uh, have him fill in for next year in one of the cars. Pato Award. Also got this year's hero card of him. Pippa Mon. That was from Dale Coin Racing. Reese Gold. Renee Binder, Rhinus VK. I think I, uh, I think I had to send out a specific request for him because I don't think I got him in a regular hero card request that I sent out. And then he was also a great signer at the track. He probably signed more than anyone, um, just in the number of times that I saw him. And I'm like, I'm not going to bother this guy again. <laughs> I've gotten uh, quite a few from him. 
uh, Robert Wickens, who of course uh, was involved in a crash in Pocono a few years ago, um, was paralyzed. He has since regained some movement. I don't know exactly where he is uh, in terms of his recovery, but I know that it was uh, it wasn't looking good for a while there. But he has been doing much much better. Again, not not one hundred percent sure about his current level of mobility, but uh, he was very fortunate to survive that wreck. Former F1 driver Romain Grosjean was able to meet him at the track. Really glad to do that. Ryan Hunter Ray. I think he works for Juncos Racing, someone told me, as like a driver coach. He was a great TTM signer. Uh, who was that? I think that's got to be an R. I do not recall. I got to label these at some point. Sage Karam. Santino Ferrucci. I believe he races in the Xfinity series as well. Sarah Fisher. She was also one of the first uh, IndyCar hero cards I got back. Scott Dixon. Been able to get him through the mail each year. I don't think I got his hero card for this year, so I might like to buy one. Scott McLaughlin, uh, he is in his second season. He is also uh, one of the Team Penske drivers that is up for the championship this year. I think he is fifth in points, and he has the least chance to win the championship. But I think all it takes is a win and a good qualifying session, and he'll be able to do it. So uh, don't... Don't bet against him. I'm still going with Will Power, but I think Scott does have a better chance than what the uh, odds would say. Got this one at a uh, Verizon store signing. Got to meet him and Will Power again when they came back around for the uh, brick or the double header between the Brickyard and the Xfinity series. Sebastian Bourdieu. him a bunch of times over the years, including on some IMSA uh, uh, hero cards. Simon Pagano. That one's from this year. Spencer Pickett. Or Pigot, I'm not, I'm not sure which one it is. Stingray Rob. Two-time Indy 500 winner, Takuma Sato. Did get his hero card from this year, I believe. Yes. Was able to get that one. Finally got Tatiana Calderon. Um, wasn't able to get her at the Indy GP because I didn't have the... Uh, I, didn't, I don't think I had the bronze badge yet uh, for that race. So I wasn't able to go through the pits. No, I got it the first day, but I didn't get to have it very long, so I didn't run into her. Uh, but finally got an autograph from her through the mail, ended up getting two. Tony Kanon. Victor Franzoni. Will Power. He's a super nice guy. He signed quite a bit, too. I was pretty surprised. He's uh, very popular at the track. Yuvin Sundara Moroti. I think that's how they were pronouncing it. I could be very, very wrong. Zachary Clement de Mello. Zach Veach. He raced for a few seasons. And I got a few IMSA or IMSA. Not sure how people pronounce it. Uh, hero cards here. I do know that, know that this one is signed by Scott Dixon, Ryan B Briscoe, Sebastian Bourdais, Bourdois, and then the other drivers are on the back, but I'm not too worried about it. Then I got this one, signed by Mario Farnbacher, and uh, I think Matt McMurray. This one's signed by all four, uh, Elio, Tom Blomqvist, Oliver Jarvis, and Simon Pagano. This one, I 
think was signed by Misha Go Goatburra? Goatburk? I don't know. And Trent Hinman. I want to send it to AJ Allmendinger, but I'm afraid of losing it. He's been a really good signer, though. I think that one's Tristan Vautier. That one is signed by two. Bourdais. And who's the other driver? Zhao Barbosa. And then, I don't know if... They, yeah, this one's signed on the back. With uh, Scott Dixon, Renger, Van Der Zand, and then... Didn't realize it for the longest time, but I had a Formula One driver and Kevin Magnuson. So I uh, found that a couple weeks ago and realized I had him. But uh, this was a really good year for me as far as IndyCar goes. Of course, uh, the bigger focus since that race has been getting as many former Indy 500 participants um, on some 4x6 photos. I already had a few from some former winners and everything. But I've been able to add a lot, and I've, I've still been writing to more and more that I can find. So uh, I will definitely show that at some point here soon. But thank you guys for watching. I really appreciate it. Uh, means a lot to me. Best luck with your guys' collecting. Take care.